Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Children's Hospital and Medical Center. We want to thank you for joining us for this very special occasion. I want to again begin by saying thank you to our special guests for making this celebration possible. Through their support, we truly have an opportunity to make a difference in the lives of children with cancer. Together, these courageous boys and girls and their families all share a common thread, and that is the hope for a cure for cancer. We're in this for the long run. We're, we're, not, we're not ever going to give up this cause. And you can count on our support that until we find the cures, we're going to fund support and research to help find the cures for cancer. So on behalf of Hyundai Hope on Wheels, Dr. Coulter, and the Omaha area Hyundai dealers, I am proud to present you and Children's Hospital and Medical Center with the 2013 Hope on Wheels grant of $250,000. Uh, thank you very much. I'd like to also add my thanks to Hyundai for having the vision to see pediatric cancer as something that they want to invest in. You know, I think if you sat down and you talked to our families, they would tell you that the treatment of pediatric cancer is a team sport. And that team is never more seen than in the treatment of neuroblastoma, which is a relatively common solid tumor that we see in children. And we have a number of families here today who have been battling that disease. And so the reason why we want to look at that is to see if there are ways that we can make that therapy work better and perhaps have less side effects. On New Year's Eve 2011, our then three and a half year old son Wade was diagnosed with stage four neuroblastoma. The journey we started that day with Dr. Coulter was one we never thought we'd be on. Um, that was a Saturday and by the following Wednesday evening, Wade started his first round of chemo. I don't think I'll ever forget the look. That tears running down Wade's face. Underneath a superhero mask, he'd wear during his pulse. Wade is three days from turning five years old and is currently considered no evidence of disease. We are very grateful to those working so hard to learn more about this horrible disease and how to treat it. And especially grateful that one of the doctors so committed to this research is Wade's doctor. We'd like to say thank you and congratulations to Dr. Coulter. <laughs> 